are worried about the safety of the sport. A lot of people have come out and said they wouldn't let their kids play football because of the health risks. In fact, if I had a son, I, I would be real leery of him playing. The number of kids under 16 playing tackle football nationwide seems to be declining. And some state lawmakers have even proposed banning it for kids under 14 entirely. It's unlikely that people are gonna just turn off the TV because they realize that sport's unethical. What's gonna kill football if it dies would be parents not letting the next generation of players put on a helmet. Got to find a way in this game to help eliminate that play right there, and I don't know how you do it. Eric Swartz from the University of New Hampshire is leading a two-year study at four high schools in New Hampshire, hoping to see if practicing without protective gear means fewer concussions in the game. Because if you take away protective gear... So there is no sense of security there. So you'll do naturally, naturally what um, you have to do to try and protect yourself, and especially dog, dog tackling. How about that? Predicated on rugby, so you see no helmets, and the idea is to get the shoulder pad to the hip with your head behind, as opposed to in front, which is, I'm sure, how they were teaching in uh, your day. <laughs>